Hello everybody, uh, I'm Farhan Mazar and uh, I will try to solve today, uh, uh, 2000, May, June 2003 uh, physics paper. We will first of all try question number one. Let's open that question. Okay, so here we have the question. Uh, figure 1.1 shows the speed time graph for the first 1.12. 125 seconds of the journey of a lorry during the motion shown describe what happens to the speed of the lorry as you can see this is a speed time graph and on the x-axis the time is represented on the y-axis the speed is 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 represented the question is during the motion describe what happens to the speed of the lorry as you can see that the speed of the lorry is gradually increasing first of all the increase is uniform and then the increase is non-uniform and at the time approximately 60 second after the 60 second till 120 second the speed becomes constant so there are three kinds of uh, there are three things that are happening with the speed uh, the speed increased uniformly Formally, uh, from zero till twenty five second, then it increased non uniformly till uh, sixty second and then speed becomes constant hopefully you understand this then the next question is the acceleration of the lorry you see uh, as you know that this is a speed time graph is given to us the slope of the speed time graph represents the acceleration so the question is what is happening with the acceleration from 0 to 25 seconds the slope is constant then the slope decreases when the slope is constant it means the acceleration is constant then the slope starts decreasing and then the slope becomes flat so it becomes zero so during this portion the acceleration is constant here we have non-uniform acceleration and in this portion the acceleration is zero so the question is what happens to the acceleration of the lorry? So the acceleration was constant from 0 to 25 seconds. Then it uh, and then it decreases this and becomes zero at 60 seconds so this is what happens with the with the speed or uh, with the acceleration of the lorry then the next question is determine the maximum speed of the lorry in meter per second and in kilometer per hour from the graph, uh, from the graph, you can see the maximum speed is this. The maximum speed is this is 20, this is 30. So maximum speed is here. So this will be probably 25 meter per second. So the speed is 25 meter per second. But their question is also converted into kilometer per. So very simple, 25 meter per second. So if you want to convert the 20 uh, meter per second speed into kilometer per hour. So what you have to do, you have to multiply with 3600 and divide with 1000 and this will be converted in kilometers per hour. The answer will be uh, 1, 2, 1, 2, this will be 9, 99, okay, so you get the 90 kilometer per hour. 
so the speed is 90 km per hour so we write here 90 km per hour i hope that you understand this question